Yud is good, yo. It's your boy Ty back here with another video. And in this video today, guys, we're going to be doing a gameplay of the new Amethyst glitched Jerry Allen card. Honestly, guys, I think Jared Allen has what it takes to be a top 10 or so center in the entire game. That's how good I think this card is could possibly be he's got 30 base total badges now his price is a little more than i maybe thought he would be but you know i bought him for 40k and obviously i'm guessing that's where his price is bound to go down from i'm guessing he's gonna settle for it from anywhere or you know right around that 20 to 25 000 mt range 610 243 pounds 91 three ball 90 standing driving dunk 90 block 80 steals 79 perimeter 92 interior great rebounding stats 79 speed 79 lateral fitness great stat wise absolutely incredible tendency wise 99 contest shot tendency one of the favorite corner specialist 22 gold badges including a lot of shooting badges some interior uh, defensive badges there seven silver badges including the silver limitless range now badges i wouldn't necessarily give him anything but if you do i don't know he doesn't really need much to be honest with you how jarrett comes is how he can compete at the highest level looking at mr jared allen here in shoot around his release I, i'm not gonna sit here and gas it and say you know it's the best release in the game but it's fine i mean i feel like his green window is pretty large because he's got a really high three ball his upper is weird though i mean that is the one thing i'll say about it i'm greening consistently with it right now but his upper is definitely weird obviously don't shoot drifters with the card even though i just made it you know that's not gonna be have you know be a good recipe for you guys so his drifter is good as far as catching and, and taking a few dribbles getting a standing dunk he should be fine i mean the afro is gonna make him look closer to seven feet taller than six ten which hey even if it's just an effect, I think that is helpful, at least for me. You know, seeing a guy that's 6'10", no afro, compared to a guy with Jared Allen, who, you know, the afro makes him at least a couple of inches taller, is a massive, massive W. So, I think I'm going to really like what Jared Allen brings to the table. I think he's a great card for budget type of players, for those budget centers, uh, you know, if you need one. For me, on my no money spent, I know I've definitely needed one, and I think Jared Allen's going to be that answer. Let's get it. Jared Allen at center with AD. AD should help him out, but I'm excited to see what he brings to the table. My opponent here, I don't know what his record is. Look at Caruso. Caruso really stopped, man, though. I'm telling y'all that right now. Caruso going to be my point guard for a, at least the foreseeable future at this rate because he really just gets me paint stops. Like, what, what else do I need him to do? Hey, Caruso. Got him. One more. Hey, D. Hey, D. Hey, D. That's a great extra pass from Jared Allen. That's horrible. Bored. Thank you, Jared. Run. I'm just confused. You don't think Jared Allen can shoot? He's literally a glitch shooting Jared Allen. He's going to be able to knock down those shots. Maybe he just thinks it's a base Jared Allen. I don't really know, but obviously I'm knocking down that shot. Oh yeah, Jared. That's good teamwork from Caruso and Jared Allen. I'm telling y'all Caruso can play AD. Attack it. Attack it. Hey, standing dunk, man. That's AD in the area. Yep, come on. It's AD. It's big AD. Hey, Caruso. Hey, Caruso. Chill. It's fine. It's big Jared Allen. It's big Jared Allen waiting there for you. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Chill. That's a horrible pass. Come here. Got him. That's big Jared Allen. He competing at the highest level. You wouldn't even know it's like an amethyst out here. And that's the biggest thing I'm trying to tell y'all is just because he's an amethyst don't mean he can't hoop. His badges are good. His stats are good there's no flaws in the card i'll be honest with you i'll take that every every play you want to take a 47 percent layup sure be my guest hit him one more back to him that's it i missed it late that's me it's because his release is just weird like it just looks so weird that's why it's so hard to time board it's jared's board run jared's got to give me that stop he's got to because that's good defense go board Mm, gotta green it. 
Green AD. AD will never miss. He's too good. Jared Allen, four points. Three rebounds. Okay. Got him. Let's get D. He knew he better come guard me after last time. 21% on a rim badge? There's no way that shot should go in. Green, there we go, finally. Perfect. You can tell when you green one, I could tell that one was in. Good shot, Jared. And even if y'all don't love Jared Allen as your uh, best center in, in your my team, he's gonna be your best option for weeks in my team limited, bro. And that's just the facts. That's just the facts, man. That's great D, Ty. It is great D. Hit him. My fault. He greened it? Oh my gosh. He might be him. Show me. Heck no, right? Jared's board. He he Yo, look at the duo. AD and Jared Allen, really the best duo. Best big duo in the game. Uh, I'm gassing it. But it's a tough duo, man. I love what I'm seeing right now out of my guys. And you can say, well, Ty, it's not even Jared Allen. Um, What I'm going to reply to that is, Jared Allen's not a big part of what I'm doing right now? Y'all don't think so? Um, I would disagree. He got 10, 4, and 3 right now. My opponent left the game, but man, oh, man. I, I was impressed with Jared Allen. And it, to me... It's bigger than the fact of, oh, he just held it down. No, he held it down as an amethyst. And and you guys know how many weeks in limited it's using amethyst player. He's by far and away the best amethyst center in the game, and it's not close. He's got a 91 three ball. He's chick. He literally greened it lightly. His player model is really, really solid. I mean, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna make the case that Jared Allen's the best center in the game, because I don't think that's valid. But I mean, as far as centers for under like 50,000 MT. I don't even think it's close. I think it's Jared Allen, a big gap, and then the next guy. Jared Allen can compete at any level. Is he better than Kevin Garnett? No. Is he better than Jermaine O'Neal? Probably not. But compare the cards. Compare him to Jermaine O'Neal. Yes, Jermaine can handle the ball, but on the defensive end, it's decently close. The only thing Jermaine has is just more total badges, and that comes with him being an amethyst in that territory. So as far as if I'm going to keep Jared Allen on this account, probably not, right? Just because, I mean, to me, he if I have Jermaine, if I have KG, he's not that useful. But as far as a card that I'm definitely going to pick up on my no money spend, Jared Allen's at the top of the list. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. Like, there's a list, and Jared Allen's at the top of it. So if you can get your hands on him for like 25,000 MT, I think you're getting a really, really solid option and a solid player in NBA 2K23, my team. So that is going to wrap it up for our video today, guys. Let me know your thoughts on Jared Allen down below in the comments. Are you guys a fan? Because I definitely am. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys. And have a blessed day.